Hi, I'm Josh Taylor, Product Manager with Cable Express, and it's time for Cable Talk. Today, we're going to talk about the spin versus the standards. There's a lot of marketing information written in a technical way that's out there that makes it really, really confusing to truly understand the value of a cable. Value is just not the cost. It's the cost measured against other factors that may be important to you, such as things like performance and repeatability. The best way to start is with the industry standards. This is the way to get the technical information, not the technical sounding marketing information. I'd recommend you start with Bixi. They're a professional association supporting the information technology systems industry. They cover voice, data, and much more. You can also look at the UL, the ETL, EIATIA, IEEE, NEC, and others. After you've learned about the standards, now you evaluate your suppliers. Keep it simple here. Ask for third-party test results. These are independent labs that test directly to the industry standards, so you can be sure it's not marketing fluff. And then you measure those results against the industry standards. That's the sweet spot. A supplier that exceeds and sticks to the standards, they have the proper documentation. You've separated the spin from the standards. It's that simple. The industry standards, third-party test results. That way you can avoid any potential gimmicks, like the one we've all heard about, the end-to-end -end warranty. That may sound good to some people, but it usually means you're locked into buying a specific brand of product, and that translates to higher pricing. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. For more information, visit us on cableexpress.com. Respect layer one.